Travis Charbonneau considers himself a cable viewer caught in the middle. On average, he watches four hours of cable daily, but he could soon need some additional equipment to watch Channel 6 and some other local television stations. Should a retransmission agreement not be reached between cable companies and channels 6, 8, and 35, Travis will need something called an AV switch and rabbit ear antennas to bring in the signal. He says the additional equipment could make TV viewing a hassle. If I tape David Letterman, it has to be flipped over through the rabbit ears. You want to tape something on cable, you have to remember to set that back. That on top of programming the VCR, which a lot of us can't do too well anyway, uh, it just seems to be, a, well, it's just sort of an unthinkable situation. That unthinkable situation as sharp it could become a reality if cable companies and channels 6, 8, and 35 don't reach an agreement. Because of the situation, we thought we'd check into just how much this additional equipment will cost cable viewers. To begin with, you'll need a set of rabbit ear antennas. On average, they run about $15 to $20. You'll also need an AB switch. At some stores, that's about $7. In addition, the cable companies say they will sell you one. Add to those items two coaxial cables, $3 a piece, and a VCR to TV signal combiner, that's an additional $7. total package will run close to $35, and that's for each television. Once you have those items, here's what you do. Hook up your antenna, put it into the A input of your AB switch, put your existing cable signal into the B input of the switch, and then take the output of the AB switch and put it into your TV set, and therefore you just flip the switch from your cable to your antenna. If this all sounds complicated, that's because for some people it is. You may want to keep October 6th circled on your calendar. If the two sides don't reach an agreement, then stations like WTVR-TV will be noticeably absent from your cable package. In Richmond, Suzanne Kennedy, WTVR, News Channel 6.